Hey guys, it is Gina from Vintage Digs, and I wanted to give you a quick sales preview to show you what I am going to be selling this week here on my channel, Wednesday at 2 p.m. Eastern, so I hope you can come out, join me. If you're not already subscribed, please do so, and hit that notification button so you will be notified of all my content and live sales that are coming up. So, first off, I have this Vintage 10 Toy Kitchen. It's got the sink and the refrigerator, which I just think is adorable. Um, I'll have a little bit of milk glass, as you see here. I've got a little mini lantern there. I have got some cute little mini cereal boxes. These are vintage as well, as well as some little Domino Sugar boxes, which go great with the kitchen. I've got a nice vintage uh, Dobbs ashtray. It looks like a top hat, black glass. Cool kind of Parisian-style vintage print back there little frosted fairy lamp, a little bit of amberina there. It does glow. It is the cream and sugar. And then I have got my um, vintage tea tins here, the tall ones, which I think are fantastic. The colors on them are great. And I got these cute little pom-pom birds. Uh, I don't know if these are handmade or what. They got the little metal feet on them, but there's all different birds in there. Great for crafting or just sitting around for your spring decor. A nice carnival glass piece there. Can you see the uh, the texture on it? It's beautiful. Then some different shades of blue glass, which you know I am in love with. I always pick up the blue. A really pretty kind of like a jack in a pulpit style of vase there with some mica in it. This really interesting vase. It's like flower shape, kind of a jack in a pulpit shape, pulled glass, art glass. And it's got kind of a darker pink that runs through it. And it's a nice swirly stem on it. I'm going to have a few brooches, as you see. A beautiful uh, turquoise and coral necklace there. A piece of Mexican pottery. The quail. Got some nice uh, details on it. And I got a few valentines I'm going to be bringing. Um... Some mid-century glassware there. There's two of them. They're in the light blush pink with the gold spaghetti on there. Um, or splatter, whatever. Spatter. They call it different things. But I love that mid-century glass. It'd be great for somebody to do for a display or for an assemblage of some kind. Nice piece of blue tiara with the birds and strawberries. It's kind of a relish dish. And these really cool mid-century uh, chopsticks, which I think are amazing. And then I have this here. This is a light. It's porcelain. It's kind of the Capo de Monte style. But it is a vintage light, like a little night light. It does work. And then I have another print back there. A nice Victorian looking lady. Reminds me of a Gibson girl. I have a pixie there. I have some green glass there, which is actually an inkwell. A nice vintage inkwell. And then a little kitty right there. I forgot who made that one. Let's see if I can show it on the bob tom. I'll probably have it upside down. I have my glasses on. But anyway, nice vintage kitty there. Uh, pretty piece of green uh, Victorian hand painted glass there. It's a vase. A Fenton uh, green canoe ashtray, glass ashtray in the button and daisy or daisy and buttons. A pretty little cherub there, or angel. Thought that would be cute for your decor for Valentine's Day. Really sweet. And then some more little kitties. So, I hope you saw something that you thought is really cool here. But, like I said, this uh, will be on Wednesday at 2 p.m. here on my channel, Vintage Digs. Please go ahead and, if you don't mind... Give me a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. And also make sure if you have been subscribed that you are still subscribed because, you know, things happen. <laughs> things get purged. So please go in there and make sure you're still subscribed and that your notifications are uh, set to all so that you can be notified. And if you are new here, my name is Gina. Thanks for popping in. Thanks all of you for watching. And I will see you very soon around the YouTube community, the vintage community that we all love so much, a great group of people. And until then...
Keep your eyes out. Keep your head on the swivel. Looking for that cool vintage stuff that we can all save and enjoy. And keep a smile on your face. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. And I will see you very, very soon. Bye for now.